Good evening, everybody. Uh, this is Silk. We're doing Operation Skyfall. This is Japan Turn 5. Uh, lots of exciting things going on now. As war starts to kind of act in, in breast here now that we're in China. All sorts of uh, fights going on, so we'll have a few things to do today. Let's start with our purchases while we got them here. We're going to have $31 to spend. We're going to spend all of it. We're going to get two artillery for eight, two marines for eight. So that's 16. We're going to advance our factory in Hanshu to stage two. That's another six for 22. Then two infantry, one cavalry for nine. 22 plus nine is 31. All right, let's get into our tech rolls. Not exactly something I'm looking forward to, given the uh, results we've had so far, but dice can't hit you all the time. All right. Uh, we've got improved construction and large ships. Gotta hope we hit at least one of these darn things. Uh, improved construction. There's a 10. Hey, 0 for 4 is off the board. I think, or 0 for 6, I should say. 0 for 4 is done, and we're not going to go 0 for 6. Um, and then large ships. Also at uh, 8. Come on! Nope, five. Well, we at least got one. That is better than zero. All right. We do have some combat here. We're gonna give you guys the top-down view. All right, um, I already talked to the KMT and CSP player about getting the way there, uh, order of loss is gonna be here. So it's a little different. Uh, they could uh, agree to an order of a loss, or if they don't agree, you got a 50-50 all the hits. So. Fortunately for ease of play, they did come to an agreement, so we've got that kind of spelled out here. Uh, so all my units that are in Suyan are going to go into Singhai. Uh, this cavalry in Rihi is going to join them. So you can just go two over. Uh, meanwhile, here into Shenxi, we're going to send this Marine along with this artillery and this motorized. And then we have all the planes. Going into Singhai, bringing both tacticals and both fighters from Korea. Off of the carrier that I have here in, uh, what was that, P32? P32. We're going to bring another tactical and another fighter. So three tacticals, three fighters going into Singhai. And then going to Shenzi, we bring the last fighter off the tactical. And that should be all of that. Now, we got to get to our invasions here. Okay, so I don't want to do this. Transport from P41 comes up 1-2. Gets used. And takes a infantry from Beiping and a marine from Shantung. And drops them off in Nanking with an amphibious attack. Then I have a destroyer here in P-14. It'll come up one, two, get one of my Marines off of Kyushu, come down to P32, drop off a Marine here in Honshu, and then this transport here in P14 will move to P, well, actually he grabs him first, doesn't he? He picks up the infantry from Shangtung, then moves to P15. Then comes down and drops off a infantry in Hunan and a marine in uh, Nanking. And then this transport here in P, what am I in? 40, 41? Picks up the infantry in Hunan, or Hainan, sorry. Infantry from Hainan, infantry for Formosa. He comes up to P32, drops both of those off 
in Hunan. All right, and then we got our bomb parts. So battleship moves from what P14 down, joins my bombard fleet down there. That gives me three and what four. That seems fine. Okay, so bombarding into uh, Nanking, I'll have a battleship and two heavy cruisers. Bombarding into Hainan, or Hunan, Hunan, darn it, all these Chinese names. Uh, bombarding into Hunan, I'll have a battleship, battle cruiser, two heavy cruisers. And that should be all the stuff we got here. So, all right, let's get to it. All right. Let's try to do easy ones first. Um, we'll start with Hunan. I have a bombard at a four with a battleship. It misses with a seven. I have a bombard with a three with a battleship. It misses with a five. We're going to trade out dice here. I've got two bombards at two with heavy cruisers. Neither one hits. That's a bummer. And then we've got, as we land, four dice at two. Could have used you guys just a little earlier, but we at least finish it. So we get our hit, and we find out if we lose Marine. He defends back at a two. Oh, see? I just get their revenge on me. There goes my first Marine. All right, uh, that will create our surrounded city in Nanking, if it matters. We've got a bombard at a four with the battleship. He misses. We've got two bombards at two with heavy cruisers. They both miss. <laughs> oh, for seven on my bombards. Jeez. And then I've got three at two against his one at one. Uh, none of those are hits. Here's another chance to lose a marine. All right, we're going to start rolling all at once now. My, my blues are me, the red is him. This may take a while. Blues are at two, the red's at a one. No, it didn't take as long. All right, so we do kill him on round two. And I don't lose Marine, so yay for that. All right. All right, uh, Shenzi, I have a first strike at a two. That's a miss. I then have a infantry, or a marine actually, boosted to a two. That's a miss. I've got a motorized at a one. That's a miss. And a fighter at six. Well, at least we got one hit. So the fighter did his job. Hopefully this doesn't get too painful. He's got two militia at twos, 10 and a five. So that gets one of them off the board. All right. Uh, we'll do our two twos. Nothing. Then we've got a six. There's our hit and a one. All right. He's got a two back. And it's okay. That gets Gen C off the board. So overall, we're at least making steady progress here. Now the unfortunate one is this fight it is by far, by far the riskiest fight. I don't know if it's even positive. I haven't calculated far enough out. Kind of doing it by instinct. Planes are gonna do some work, but if they don't. I'm in trouble. All right. Well, I've got three tacticals with target select at sevens. Uh, no target selects, but we do register two hits. I have three fighters at six. Uh, five and a six. All right, this is solid. I'm, I'm 
happy to stay on this pace as long as the planes do the work. Decent chance I win this fight here. So a CCP infantry dies, and then a KMT infantry steps in, and he dies. All right. Now I've got my cav, which is four of them, and a mountain. So now I've got five twos. Whole lot of nothing. But the planes are hidden, so I can't complain too much about that. And then two infantry at once. Not very likely, but you never know. All right, so four hits, not bad. Okay. He's got two twos with his uh, it, militia. Oh, ho, 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 shit. <laughs> Oh, lovely. That's awesome. And terrible all at the same time. Uh, three, five, fours. Watch me get just wrecked here. Uh, well, okay, that kind of makes up for it. He only gets one hit with uh, his fours. And then two fives. And one more hit with the fives. All right, so I lose four, he loses four. Uh, I lose two infantry and two calf. A little sad, but life is what it is. He loses two militia and one CCP infantry and one KMT infantry. All right. Five hits to go, I think. One, two, three, four, five hits to go. All right. Three tacticals. That's it. A target select, which will be a mountain if it matters, and then one one hit there. So that's two hits. I then have three at sixes. Only one hit, because the seven and the nine miss. So that's grim. So that gets me a total of three. And then three twos, as we are running out of dudes. And nothing. So I kill three. One of which is a mountain. So we lose a mountain, a KMT infantry, and a CCP infantry. And then coming back at me are three at four. Two hits. Ow. And two at five. Whoo. That almost, I mean, it, it, this battle bit me, but that almost really, really bit me. Uh, so I have to retreat because I'm out of dudes. And he holds it with a infantry and a mountain. So congratulations to uh, CCP there. That was definitely a fight I was worried about. Those militia both hitting kind of threw that fight off on me, I think. Yeah, my planes didn't do real great either on the second turn. They did plenty good on the first turn. Getting four hits. But... Alright, uh, so let's do our non-combat movements. Alright, so all seven planes land in Suyan. This infantry moves to uh, Suyan. Uh, these three submarines and Palau will come down to P60. Um, these two destroyers in P14 will go to P16. These two transports here in P was this 50? P41. We'll go into port here in P15. Well, mostly worked except for the fact that I lost my whole northern army. That did not work at all. So a little sadness for us there. Let's go ahead and place our units here. Um, we do get a single cavalry. For Rehi, 
EAS. Um, our factory goes to stage two. I'm gonna go ahead and put two Marines in Tokyo. And I'm gonna put two infantry and two artillery in Kaishu. All right, uh, Rihi has a cav. Siyan has an infantry in the seven aircraft. Shanxi is motorized artillery marine. Uh, Nanking is, what, two marines, one infantry. Uh, Hun Hunan, yeah. Hunan is three infantry. Uh, the units in Quang Tung is the same. Four Marines, three infantry, one artillery. Um, Kaiyushu is two infantry, two artillery. Tokyo is two Marines. And then my boats, I've got two destroyers in P-16, two transports in port in P-15. P-14 is a battleship, two heavy cruisers, and a transport. P-32, two transports. Oh, these guys are here. Right? Yeah. Uh, two transports. Destroyer. Torpedo boat destroyer. Battleship. Heavy cruiser. Two cruisers. Along with a carrier. A light carrier. Two light cruisers. And I guess in a second, torpedo boat destroyer. So I'll repeat that for clarity there. P-32, battleship, heavy cruiser, two heavy cruisers, fleet carrier, light carrier, two light cruisers, two torpedo boat destroyers. And then my three submarines are all the way down here. And I'll leave my coastal subs where they're at. So there we go. That's it. Uh, we'll turn it on over to uh, Panzer J for Commonwealth. Um... I gained six, seven, eight, but lost one. Income should be 38 for next turn. Or cash on hand should be 38 for next turn, I should say. Um, let me know. Check on that for me, guys. And that's all we got. So uh, take care, and I'll see you in a day or two.